What it do, Dream Team? It's your boy D Neil and Mackenzie back with another reaction video, guys. Here we are with Prince Andrew. Definitely not being suspicious at all. A compilation of it. Before we dive in, y'all know what we need. Subscribe, ring notification bell, give the video a thumbs up. Now let's hit it. Well, there was only one story dominating the news this week. For nearly a decade, a member of the royal family has been dogged by questions about his friendship with a convicted paedophile. In a world exclusive, we go inside Buckingham Palace to ask about his friendship with Jeffrey Epstein. Tonight, Prince Andrew, the Epstein scandal. Did you watch the interview? Absolute car crash. It would be um, a, a, a considerable stretch to say that he was a very, very close friend. Really? You've been on his private plane. Yes. You've been to stay on his private island. Yes. You've stayed at his home in Palm Beach. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> How much closer can you get, dog? <laughs> <laughs> You're lying. Hardly saw the guy. Sure, I've stayed in every one of his houses and I've got a tattoo of his face on my back, but... We're not besties. <laughs> it was insane. Look how he describes <laughs> Epstein. Do I regret the fact that, that, that he has quite obviously conducted himself in a manner unbecoming? Yes. Unbecoming? He was a sex offender. <laughs> <laughs> he was a sex offender. I love the reporter, dog. Unbecoming? He was a sex offender. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Oh my god. Who describes a sex offender as unbecoming? <laughs> what do you think of Hitler? Rascal. <laughs> <laughs> Isis. Scallywags. <laughs> and more, look at the reason he gives for staying with Epstein. But you were staying at the house of yes. a convicted sex offender. It was a convenient place to stay. Were all the hotel books? <laughs> Plaza, no. Marriott, no. What's this? Spare bedroom run a nonce's house. <laughs> oh, <my laughs> it gets madder. Andrew claimed he only stayed with Epstein to tell him they could no longer be friends. But he then stayed round his house for the next four days. <laughs> How does no. that work? We cannot be friends. I'm a member of the royal family and we will not socialise with sex offenders. I will see you at dinner. <laughs> <laughs> and breakfast tomorrow and tennis on Tuesday. And we're, we're still on for Jersey Boys, but after that, we are... <laughs> Andrew was also accused of having sex with a 17-year-old girl. Look at the bizarre reason he claims he never met her. She described dancing with you no. and you profusely sweating <laughs> and that she went on to have baths, there's a, there's possibly... A, there's a slight problem with, 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 with the sweating um, because uh, I, I have a peculiar medical condition which is that I don't sweat um, or I didn't sweat at the time <laughs> and that was... Oh, was she? Yes. I didn't sweat at the time because I... Um, ha had suffered what I would describe as an overdose of adrenaline in the Falklands War when I was shot at, uh, and I simply, it, it, was, it, was, it was almost impossible for me to, to, to sweat. Bro. <coughs> Come on. Like, I don't like... <laughs> like, that's your excuse? Like, that's your way of getting out of it? Uh, I don't know. I didn't sweat at the time. <laughs> I don't know how much time he had to prepare for this interview. I don't know if he knew the questions I was going to be asked. He couldn't have. Bro, he's stuttering. I mean, he's lying. He, he stuttered with every word. Mm -hmm. And I'm like, there's no time you could have had to prep for this interview, dog. Because you would have came up with much better lies than this, dog. Yeah. I just did swear <laughs> it, <the time. laughs> I would have just much preferred you say, uh, no, I didn't do it. She's lying. Yeah. Stop it at that. You didn't need to get because that excuse lets us know you're lying, Prince. I didn't sweat at the time, dog. Stop the cap right now. 
simply, it, it, was, it, was, it was almost impossible for me to, to, to sweat. <laughs> I can't sweat because I'm actually part camel. And <laughs> I can no longer achieve <laughs> erection because, because of... 9-11. <laughs> Can't swear. I bet the Queen was like, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> 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 is he A son's an absolute moron! <laughs> 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 he makes Charles look like Stephen Fry! <laughs> <laughs> I can't sweat because uh. of war. I've watched many war films. I've heard of Trenchfoot. I've heard mm -hmm. of Shock. Yeah. Very little about B.O. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to save some money on Roll-On. I'm going to have to buy Lynx Africa again. <laughs> Absolutely mad. It gets weirder. Look what he claims he was on the night of the allegations. On that particular day that, that, that um, uh, uh, we now understand is the date, which is the 10th of March, uh, I was at home. Uh, I was with the children. I'd taken Beatrice to uh, a pizza express in Woking. It's funny, isn't it? He can't remember meeting a woman and having a photo with her. He can remember a pizza he had 18 years ago. <laughs> I'll never forget the 10th of March 2001. I had a sloppy Giuseppe. I was wearing a T-shirt that said, I am not a nonce. <laughs> <laughs> Granny Fanny forever. <laughs> wow, that, yeah, that joke is straight capping his whole interview, I swear. You know? <laughs> like, it's so noticeable. <laughs> bro, I know the public of British had to watch this and be like, bro, come on, dog. Yeah. <laughs> we knew you was lying before the interview, but now lock him up and throw away the key. <laughs> like gilfs. <laughs> Heating was on full blast, didn't notice. <laughs> <laughs> now, talk, I don't know what that was either. Talking. <laughs> Talking of the photo, here's another jaw-dropping excuse. I mean, that is that is what I would describe as as, as me in, in that in that picture. But I can't. We can't be certain as to whether or not that's my hand. <laughs> it wasn't my hand. My hand was at ZZ <laughs> Basin. <laughs> just, just lifting up an American. <laughs> 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 That's not my hand. She's nah. not real. Those aren't stairs. How could that not be your head, dog? It, right. <laughs> it wouldn't even make sense, Prince Andrew. It, it, you're the only one that's right there around her. This man, wow, dog. Just tell yeah, the truth. Yeah, like, that's deaf, bro. At this point, just just hold up to it, man. Apologize about it. But <laughs> this is sad, dog. We can't be sure that that's my head. It's Why we take a picture with her? <laughs> Oh, that, right. They pose for it. Right. No. And my hand isn't creepily clawing my penis. <laughs> he showed no empathy for Epstein's victims, but he did have time for one last bit of bullshit. I am not one to, um, as it were, hug and um, public displays of affection are not something that, that I do. Oh, really? He just forgot that his whole past in this interview. Like Bro. people wasn't gonna research and look up all this stuff, dog. No, <laughs> he didn't care to, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that joke is a trip, man. Prince Andrew, you a trip, dog. <laughs> I bet you money he's fucking sweating now. <laughs> yeah, he is. Did anyone else see Prince Charles' speech at the conference? Work together to rescue this precious planet and save 
the threatened future of our young people. Wise words. So what practical advice has he got that we can all follow? My old Aston Martin, which I've had for 51 years, runs on, can you believe this, surplus English white wine. <laughs> Just fill up your car with Chardonnay. <laughs> surplus wine. British people don't have leftover wine. <laughs> the bottle's opened, it's getting finished. <laughs> <laughs> this is funny because it reminds me of something my little bro uh <laughs> my little bro he was getting wasted one time and his like mom took away the alcohol from him it was like you're done matthew and he, <laughs> and he yelled back he said i ain't done till the bottle finished <laughs> <laughs> I was, and he was wasted at the time, dog. I was dead, bro. <laughs> I ain't to the bottle finish. was at the conference. Ugh. The Queen will miss the COP26 climate summit in Glasgow following advice to rest. Did you see one of the reasons why she's had to rest? The Queen is knackered because she's been staying up <laughs> watching <laughs> TV. <laughs> Netflix will do it to you, dog. If you start binging and it'll do it to you. Fucking squid game, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm obsessed. You've told me it is. <laughs> Wanna come round mine, watch some Koreans get shot on the head when they play marbles? Probably would have said not the thing. Turns out I'm hooked. <laughs> and the Queen's Gambit. Oh. I mean, that's Ooh, what we call that was good. But <laughs> it's still a lot of fun. <laughs> Talking of news readers, fair to say the crisis was covered differently in America compared to Britain. Here's the BBC. Taliban leaders who've never been seen in public before have been making their first statements on Afghan soil to a world still shocked by their lightning victory. And here's Fox News. So it's hot boy summer in Afghanistan and the Taliban <laughs> is driving <laughs> 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 Hot boy summer. Fox News is crazy, dog. <laughs> this lady had pity. The scenes from Kabul International Airport are frightening and heartbreaking. And this man had a plan. Give me nine guys. I'm going to walk through the streets and I'm going to kill everyone I see and I'm going to grab the Americans. It is not difficult. <laughs> it is. <laughs> <laughs> They've got 85 billion bullets. You'll have more holes in you than a Prince Andrew alibi. <laughs> Mind you. Mind you, Ellie's probably sweating this week, isn't it? Mind you. The sun are always doing this, winding people up about stories we just don't care about. I mean, they're even trying to make us angry about board games. Fury, as woke Scrabble bosses look to ban words such as farting, no. movies, and arse. Nobody is furious about that. No, not no, at all. Dave. No, I'm not. <laughs> They've only fucking messed with Scrabble. <laughs> <laughs> even if people cared, which they don't, how are they going to police this? They're not going to break into people's houses. Freeze! Do you put clit on a triple letter? <laughs> <laughs> People will always swear when they play Scrabble. In fact, yeah. we'll use any word to win. If the Queen was playing Prince Andrew and the word once was on the board and she had seven ends... <laughs> <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry, Andy. That's how I feel when we play Udo and I gotta do something about the kids, y'all. I'm sorry, Kenzie, but... <laughs> he always sorry. I gotta win. <laughs> he dirty. We don't get along when we play Udo. No, bro, but she want to play all the time. <laughs> I be saying, I don't know if it's good for our relationship. Because he cheat. I don't I play by the rules. His rules. The rules that you said, what do you mean? No. You choose the rules. No. That's not how he plays. I'm just a winner, y'all. It's in my blood. It's who I am. He dirty. It's what I am. And I show no mercy. No, oh, look, that was perfect time.
Oh, that was a good video though. Uh, Prince Andrew, we definitely know whatever crime they was talking about you committed, you committed it, dog. Yeah, you did. <laughs> For sure, did. <laughs> Are you good? You in the? You're part of British royalty, so you might not be convicted for it, but you committed it, dog. For sure. That's all we got. Make sure y'all subscribe, read notification bell, give the video a thumbs up, and we out.